by the time we got further into the competition, especially, we were all so emotionally invested in it. Like yeah. it's such a roller coaster of emotion. You're so like you believe in them. You just love these guys. You see how inspiring they are, how hard they work. And so when things and there are sometimes when there's quite dramatic mm. um, moments when things go wrong, and it was like the whole the whole room just stops breathing. Like it's just like totally like oh no what's what do we like don't know what to do. It's like like there was one point very near the end when it was like it was like a death had happened. It was like everyone was like oh. Uh, I didn't like didn't know where to look, didn't know what to say. It was yeah. it's very dramatic. But some of the other like teams, they take it so well when something bad happens. So they might start laughing. So that gives license to <laughs> everyone to start yeah. laughing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just yeah. depends on <laughs> what team it is. I mean, <laughs> yeah. There, and of course, like cakes are quite funny. Like if a cake falls off a plate, it, it's quite <laughs> like it moves so slowly. Yeah, there yeah, was, yeah. There was one like that where it just sort of went, <laughs> and it was like, a really like pivotal like judging moment. And it just went. Uh, uh. I just wondered, like, what was what was your cake knowledge prior to the show, and what was your cake knowledge like after? I mean, were you were you there having to learn quite a lot in order to kind of understand? Well, I did food technology GCSE. I don't mean to uh, intimidate anybody, but um, <laughs> I got an A star, and it was for a project about sandwiches. Beyond that, really, I don't. I like cooking, but for me, it was kind of like I tried to learn as I was going along because I thought, well, that's probably what the viewers will be trying to do as well. So. Yeah. Liam's the, the boss. Um, yeah, because obviously I bake. Oh. But yeah, 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 I bake. So I kind of have like some knowledge, but like some of the stuff that the, like the chefs come up with and some of the things that Ben Wine and Cherish talk about, you're like, what is that? But obviously, because I'm so like, you know, interested in taking my baking like further, questions after questions after questions, even like small things like bergamot. Oh, yeah. You What's know, that? up to now, I'm not entirely sure what bergamot is. <laughs> but I know it go it's like flavour, like some sort of flavour, which is pretty cool. Yeah. And miso, I didn't know what miso was, but now I do. Miso? Mm. Like in Japanese? Yeah. Mm. Okay. How would you, so that's is that like salty? Is that a Ah mm. you have to find out. Mm. Yeah, there's some amazing flavours I'd say, like things I would never have thought of putting together. A lot of like um like matcha tea as well seem to be used. Yeah, matchas yeah. And yuzo. Yuzu. 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 Is, is, is the temptation at the end of any particular round, when a cake is particularly good, just to say, I'll take this home? I mean, do you... Do you well, I mean, firstly, it's not cake, it's entremet. But um, secondly, <laughs> that's what I learned, see? Or petit um, gâteau. Or petit gâteau. Again, it's great French. Great French. Um, no, we never got a chance again, because all the crew... You gotta Ate be, it. You've got to be so quick on this show. You, like... You've got to have. A, ideal is to have a spoon in your back pocket, and then when they when they call that it's like all clear. You, I mean, you've got if you don't go in quick, you won't have it, and you're lucky if you get a spoonful of yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, are they do they just are they gannets? Are they just circling constantly waiting? Especially when they get good praise. Yeah. Those ones. Yeah. Go, like. That's why we have to kind of taste on the job. You know, when we go around to each bench. Yeah. Mm -mm. Oh, this is nice. This oh, is nice. Ooh, mm -hmm. this is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Any spares that were left, like on the tray, like they know what they so they make extra anyway. So yeah, you've got to get in quick then, because otherwise, as well, because with filming, they would clear the kitchen quite quickly. So you'd have to yeah, be like, yeah, yeah. oh gosh, I've got okay. like otherwise it'll be in the bin. <laughs> Pretty much.